Let's go to John chapter 3, verse 19. To the left is the King James Version. To the right is the Expanded Bible. And this is the condemnation that light is come into the world. And men loved darkness rather than light. Because their deeds were evil. So what is this saying here? So who is the light of the world? Jesus Christ. So when you live in, abide in Jesus Christ, you become the light of the world as well. Okay. So as in, when you follow his rules and regulations, righteousness, you become the light of the world. So men loved darkness rather than light. So what this is saying, some people love their sin more than doing right, doing what God wants us to do. And you may say, Kevin, you are wrong. You are so wrong. Be quiet. Okay, listen. Myself. I don't like fish. I truly dislike fish because fish to me, in many cases, is gross to me. I can't be tempted to eat fish or liver. Liver to me is so gross. I can't be tempted to eat fish eggs because to me, fish eggs is so or looks so nasty. I can't be tempted to eat squid, octopus, and all of these different whatever <laughs> looks so strange, looks so nasty. I am not going to eat it. Chances are. So I can't be tempted to eat those things because they look nasty. They look gross. I don't like that gamey, fishy, ocean, river taste. I don't like it. So chances are, I am not going to eat it. Okay, please listen. So if you are still fornicating, masturbating, cursing, stealing, fighting, and doing all of these different types of sin, chances are you still like sin. Please listen. You still like sin. If you continue to fall into sin over, and over, and over, and over, and over again, chances are you still like sin. Okay. Make sense? So you may be saying, what can you do? Fast. Don't eat anything or drink anything for a particular time period. No eating or drinking, try three days. Myself, the longest I went was, was almost seven days. I was about two or three hours from seven days. Yes, I was so hungry. Yes, I was so thirsty. Yes, I was so weak yes i was in pain some some pain but it was worth it and a supernatural thing happened as well something some people perhaps may not believe yes Afterward, something evil happened. <laughs> so crazy. 
but it was worth it. It was really, really worth it. And you may say to me, Kevin, I am sick and I have to eat every four hours or I can die. Or I need to drink something every two hours or I can die. Or if I think about fasting, I can die. Listen, you have to take your mind off your situation and place it on God. I believe someone told me, and I can't be wrong, if you don't eat anything for three days, that you can die. How crazy is that? There are people I know that fast about seven days or more, and they are alive now. So don't believe in all of this trash out there. Well, Kevin, I have cancer. Oh, I have diabetes. I have this. I have that. When are you going to trust in God? Stop thinking so much into it and do it. Sometimes when you think too much into it, that is enough to sway you from it, to get you to change your mind. Do it. Stop planning. Stop contemplating. And do it. Stop making plans. Do it. Just do it. Let me stop here. God bless you. Yes. While you fast, pray and read your Bible. Make sure you repent as well. God bless you.